Princess Charlene is making a rare red carpet appearance with her husband, Prince Albert. The royal couple stepped out with their relative Camille Gottlieb for the 74th annual Red Cross Gala in Monaco on Saturday. Charlene stunned in a sheer white beaded floor-length gown. She paired her angelic style with diamond earrings and her classic pixie cut. Her husband looked regal in a matching white tuxedo jacket with red accents. The pair posed with other guests when they arrived, and the princess carried a bouquet of flowers. The 45-year-old's attendance at the event comes after she spent most of 2021 at a treatment facility for exhaustion, both emotional and physical. In April 2022, she finally returned home to her husband and 8-year-old twins. Princess Charlene also made an unexpected show of support at King Charles' royal coronation in May. Following the historic event, DailyMail.com's Charlie Langston broke down all the top moments from the coronation with Access Hollywood. Prince Louis continues to steal the show at every single official event he takes part in. Now, we know that Louis was not given a specific role in the coronation like his older brother George, simply because he is too young to be expected to take on that kind of responsibility. But he still found a way to get the cameras over to him by yawning, pulling faces during the ceremony. He had a really wonderful reaction with his sister Charlotte, where she was kind of showing him what to do, what to sing. He was having none of it. He sat back yawning with his mouth wide open on the way to Buckingham Palace after the coronation. He was seen in the back of the carriage pulling all manner of faces. There were more yawns, there were smiles and waves, there were funny faces, there were insane expressions. He really is just showing that even as a prince, he is still a wonderfully rambunctious little boy who is being taught by his parents that yes, he needs to behave, but he doesn't need to not have a personality. William and Kate have always valued their children's individual personalities above any royal duties. And I think that Louis's behavior is a really wonderful example of how well they've managed that. Obviously, once he got up onto the Buckingham Palace balcony, I think we were all disappointed not to have a repeat of the Jubilee when he was seen putting his hands over his ears because of the fly past. But once again, he was making his sister Charlotte laugh with his antics. He was at one point playing fake piano on the balcony, which I thought was quite funny. All in all, he just proved himself to be a very energetic young man, and I think everyone is desperate to see him in another setting where we might get a few of these funny cheeky moments.